It's time for College Hoops on 2K Sports. The Texas State Bobcats battle the Florida Gators. We're really excited to bring you this matchup. Hi there, everyone. We're here at the O'Connell Center. I'm Vern Lundquist here with Bill Raftery and Tracy Wolfson. Give us your take, Bill. This game features a great matchup at the point guard position. Atchison is clearly up there with the greatest point guards in the nation. He's got fantastic ball handling ability. He can make defenders look foolish sometimes. Mack can also hold his own at the point. You can't help but notice what a smart player he is. He understands all the little aspects of the game. Both looking to lead their teams to a win. We'll see who succeeds. O'Connor hands it off. Lemon scores the opening field goal. He's got two. Hagen inbounds the ball. Let's check in with our sideline reporter, Tracy Wilson, who has some info for us. Thanks, Vern. A little while ago, I talked with the Gators coach. He told me that they want to use their quickness to their advantage. He said they couldn't think of another squad that could match their team's speed, and he wants to make sure that shows tonight by getting out on the break and showing how fast this game can be played. Guys? Thank you, Tracy. May by Bree. And they lead by two. to the paint. Shafina wipes the board off the window. Oh boy, he had it and he pulled the string. Yes, that's a shot he very easily could have made. Finished nicely down low on that last shot. The Gators will retain possession. Nice heads up defensive work. Believe me, little plays like that eventually seep into your opponent's heads. Holbrook inbounds the ball. Lemon catches it high post Bush dumps it off Holbrook skips it down low left wing Atchison from deep O'Connor snatches the rebound put up and in on that last layup he's in his element when it comes to the putback bill he wants it badly he wants it more than anyone else that's for sure and he gets what he wants Takes it up. The big slam was thrown down by Shafino. They increase their lead to four. Under 13 minutes left in the half. One on one. The offensive rebound by Holbrook. Oh, the big fellow with a tough rebound. No denying him on that one. Passes to the top of the key. Hagen. Shafino gets it. Out left. Feeds. Out right. Yeoman. Gets it. Right block. Shafino puts it up. Green keeps it alive on the offensive end. The last shot laid gently in. He gets up close and personal and closes the deal. Leaves no room for error and no room for anybody to do anything about it. Bush, no look pass to the baseline. That last 16 footer by O'Connor. Bush, terrific job to rotate the ball around and hit the open man. Bree inbounds the ball. Right wing. O'Connor gets the reach in call, and that's his first foul. Both teams are going to shake things up a little bit with some subs. That's really a tough injury to play through, Vern. You lose all your explosiveness. We'll see how he does out there. Beats it to the left side. Coggin hands it off. Yeomans. Backs him down. Walters has it. Baseline. 
Throws it up. The 11 footer was offline by Marcus Sobich. But they still lead by four. Dishes outright. Bush shoots it. No good from three point land. Markusevic fought for that rebound. That's some toughness for you. Walters dishes to the right side. Out left. Passes it to the top of the key. Mack, good from three-point range. They're in front, 13 to six. Under 11 minutes left in the half, Florida takes its first time out of the game. They're getting set to inbound the ball. Lemon inbounds the ball. Louts tosses it up. Answers right back with his own three. And they're now behind by four. Yeoman dishes it to the left wing. From long range, Holbrook calls in the board. Holbrook went after that rebound hard. Great work. Holbrook gets it to fall. They narrow the gap to two. Walters passes it up court. Rises and dishes. Good job on the layup by Markusovic. And they're now out in front by four. Goes up. The slam dunk by Lennon. But they're still down by two. Leads him in. To the free throw line. Mack passes it to the wing. Marcus Sovich puts it up. Can't hit the turnaround jumper. Still a two-point lead. Fires. Lemon yanks it down inside. Hogan inbounds the ball. There's no question what kind of defense they're in, Vern. Minimum. Yeoman sinks it. He's got four. Florida has had serious problems with their interior defense. And Tracy has a report from their bench. The Gators coach is definitely aware of that problem. He told his assistants that they have to bring more defenders into the paint, even if it means leaving the perimeter open. Desperate measures here, Vern. Thanks, Tracy. Mack dumps it off. The tough shot. Knocks down the first one. He gets the second to fall as well. Holbrook inbounds the ball. Under nine minutes left in the half. Bounce pass. Right side. Atchison gets it. Left side. Bush dishes to the wing. Misfired on that last three by Lauders. Oh, the big fella with a tough rebound. No denying him on that one. Rises and dishes. Top of the key. Swings it to the left wing. Mack. McGowan has it. Right wing. Pass. Top of the key. Three. Hooked away. But it's recovered by Texas State. Only a few seconds left in the shot clock. Shafina shoots from the post. Connects. And they're up by four. Lemon inbounds the ball. Bush at the controls. Catches it. Right wing. Crosses it over. Mack is tagged with the reach. And that's his first foul of the game. The Gators are making a few lineup changes. He should concentrate on just getting good position instead of flailing away at the ball like that. To the elbow. 
O'Connor. Swing pass, right wing. That offensive rebound didn't come to him by accident. He knew right where to be. And they're now down by two. Shafino catches it, left wing. Releases. The three ball was good by Mack. He's two for three from beyond the arc. The Gators had been seeded quite high in the past, but it wasn't until 2006 that they lived up to expectations by winning it all. Green dumps it to the paint. Last shot laid in by Shafino. With the D just standing around, it's just too easy. You know he's dropping that one in. Passes to the baseline. Bush. Dishes to the elbow. Laut lets it go. Green pulls it in. That's not a shot you expect him to miss. I'd tell him to take it again if he gets the same look. Randolph gets it. Right wing. Feeds. Out left. Mack. Gets it. High post. Shafina with the charge. And they'll turn it over. He took a licking on that one. But he took his medicine and got the charge. Love that. He's put his body on the line for the team. Onions. Holbrook inbounds the ball. The Gators with some difficulties. By yourself, by yourself. Ebong skips it to the free throw line from about 19 feet. Nothing but net by Faye. They draw to within three. Green tosses it up court. Leads him with the pass. Ebong gets the rebound. The Gators, a three, would tie the game. The defense went all over that shot. He had nothing to work with. Feeds it to the right. Ebong from 17 feet out. Hagen gets the board inside. Wow, his mid-range game is generally solid. He can't believe it, and I can't believe it. Hagen. Passes it to the top of the key. It's deflected, but it's retrieved by Markusovic. Kogan catches it on the free throw line. Flip up and in on that last layup. So pretty. There aren't many guys who can pull that move off, but he certainly did it there. Dumps it inside. Faye has it outright. Yeomans dishes it to the elbow. Passes to the left. Green hands it off. Yeomans dishes to the right side. Marcus Sovich has it down low. The last shot laid gently in. Boy, what a delicate finger drop. He's one of the best. Just sit back and enjoy the show. By yourself, by yourself. Skip pass, left side. O'Connor goes up. Nice job on the assist by O'Connor. But they're still behind by five. They're set up in minimum. Yeomans bounces it to the wing. Down low. Feeds it to the top of the key. Lewis. Ebong launches one from beyond the arc. The Bobcats, all time. Both teams will make some substitutions. McGowan inbounds the ball. Passes it to the left side. Passes outright, but it's recovered by Texas State. From the right block, got the whistle, and they'll shoot a pair of free throws. Didn't 
it's hit for long, and he's coming back into the ball game. And he'll come away one of two. The Gators can tie it with a three. the first, Walters is coming onto the floor. He gets them both. Marcus Sovich inbounds the ball. Leads him in. Walters picks it up. Laid in with the D draped all over him. They're now up by three. 2.36 left in the first half. Lemons. Marcus Silva hauls it in. That's his third rebound of the contest. He must have thought someone was rotating over to block that. You can't lose concentration even for a second. McGowan dishes it to the baseline. Stolen away by Florida. The D was really waiting for him there. That's how you do it. Keep the heat on. Wait for the misstep and then capitalize. Skips it to the right. Marcus Sovich backs in. Yeomans dumps it off. McGowan passes it back to the high post. Marcus Sovich catches it inside. Missed it from eight feet out. But they're still out in front by one. Bounce pass. Right wing. Goes up. Slam down by Holden. They're leading 34 to 33. Walters inbounds the ball. Marcus Sovich. Flip up and in on his last layup. What a great setup on that delivery. What a play. This crowd is going insane. I love the energy of this building. Listen to them. Bush takes it up. Just missed it. No three-point opportunity. He'll go to the line for two. Makes the first. He gets the second to fall as well. Marcus Sovich, lead pass inside. The Gators on a bit of a roll here. Uh, not a good entry pass, Fern. You just can't force it in there. Nice move and pay the last one. Five fake. Yeoman. Hands it off. Passes it to the high post. Hogan. Deflects the pass. And it's gathered up by Holger. I'd love to see that. He's working around and pass. Such a deep run. Six second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Nice catch on that last three by Faye. What I like is his ability to see the floor and get it to the guys where they can do something with it. Extremely accurate. Faye inbounds the ball. Bush brings it up court. Power jam. That's just raw power. Impressive physicality indeed. Swings it to the wing. Faye gets it far side. The last shot missed in three-point range. Last shot missed by Holbrook. We'll head into the break with the score. 41 to 37. Give us your opinion on the first half, Bill. I can't think of too much good to say about this game, so Vern, maybe you can do play-by-play -play and color. Now we'll bring you our player of the half. Who's your pick, Bill? Faye has been just deadly, Vern. The hoop must look five feet wide to him right now because it doesn't seem like he's missing anything, inside or out. He's been an offensive force. Absolutely on fire. Tremendous effort from our player of the half.
We're all set to begin the second half, so let's get back into it. The Texas State coach has a new lineup that isn't extremely experienced. This could have an effect on the team's chemistry. Let's see. Hogan inbounds it to start the second half. Passes to the stripe. Shafino backs down. Anticipates the pass. Tracy Wilson has more on what went on in halftime. Tracy? During halftime, I talked with the head coach. He told me his team is down, but he's going to push the issue even more in the second half to make a comeback. He went on to say that he wasn't going to mix up his rotation, even though he knows he has talent on the end of his bench. He felt that the players he used in the first half give him the best chance of winning this game, and he won't stray from that game plan. Back to you, Vern. Nice work, Tracy. Knocks down the first one. On the second. Stone in the way. The D was really waiting for him there. That's how you do it. Keep the heat on. Wait for the misstep and then capitalize. Mack dumps it off. Baseline. Feeds it to the right. Pulls the trigger. The shot was banked in by Shafino. He's five for seven for the game. Bay. Puts it up. Nice speed by Bush. Nine points, and he's the top scorer for his team. Coggin inbounds the ball. Matt hands it off. Shafino catches it. Face off. Shoots it. Knocks it down off the nice move. He's shooting 75% for the game. Dish, right wing. Fay puts up the tray. Gets it to go. He's shooting 66% from deep. About 13 and a half minutes left in the second half. Yeoman with the shot. Collected inside by Lemons. Nice work by the big fella to get that rebound. Bush goes up. Missed. Reed has picked up his first foul of the game. And he makes the first. Marcus Sovic is needed out on the floor. He didn't get much of a rest. He gets the second to fall as well. Marcus Sovic inbounds the ball. It looks like they're playing minimum. Unloads. The bucket down low. Good by Bree. They're now behind by four. Holbrook takes it up. He had a chance for a three-point play, but couldn't get the slam. He'll shoot a pair of foul shots. Shooting two. Knocks down the first one. Gets them both. Under 13 minutes left in the second half. Mack dumps it off. Right side. Marcus Sovich backs him down. Stolen by Florida. I like how he gets himself into defensive position at the right place at the right time yet again. Passes it to the left. Atchison dishes it to the top of the key. Bush, the spin move. He gets hammered, and he'll head to the strike. Shooting two. Knocks down the first one. Gets them both. O'Connor got a quick breather, but they need him back on the floor. Marcus Sovich inbounds the ball. Intercepted by Holger. 
Terrific read by the defense right there. Saw the long ball coming and made the pick. These fans are loving it. We got a packed house in here, and they're going ballistic. They've now scored 13 unanswered points. Marcus Sovich has it. High post. Pass. Outright. Shoots. Passed in from the low block by Bree. They cut the lead to eight. Lemon. One on one. Gets it. Right wing. Atchison shoots from the top of the key. Hits right rim and doesn't fall. They've still got an eight point lead. Coggin dumps it to the inside. Yeomans hands it off. Right wing passes down low. Holbrook. Got it! And they now go up by 10. Marcus Silva inbounds the ball. The Bobcats with some difficulties. Yeoman has it. Right corner. Feeds. Baseline. Three. Catches it. High post. Mack feeds it to the right wing. Backs in. Tosses it up. The turnaround shot was off the mark by Marcus Silva. A little sloppy on the release. You're right. Just a little, but it cost him there. They're bringing the double team. Right side. O'Connor takes the shot. Hits the jumper. The Texas State coach wants to talk it over with his troops. Hey, if you've got the timeouts, you might as well use them. You can't take them to the bank with you. About ten and a half minutes left in the second half. Yeoman dumps it off. McGowan. Shafina backs in. And in close. Lemon grabs the rock. Holbrook gets it in the paint. Dishes. Baseline. Throws it up. Snatched by Marcus Sovich. But they're still up by 12. Shafina catches it. Left wing. McGowan with the leaner. O'Connor throws it in off the glass. Here is the break. Takes it up. Well, the D did a nice job of disrupting him a little bit. That's tough work down low. He's got eight. To the inside. Took loose. And it's picked up by Florida. Picked him clean. Well, the game just slows down for him to the point he sees things that others don't. Texas State needs to cut down on the turnovers. And Tracy is near their bench. Tracy? The head coach stood in front of the bench a moment ago and said, if we can't hold on to the ball any better than this, there is no way we can win this game. Guys, he's trying to get his message across loud and clear. Thanks, Tracy. No way he was coming up empty when he got the ball that close to the rim. Skips it to the free throw line. Stolen away by McGowan. Oh, the quick hands. Before they even knew what hit them, he made off with that one. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Texas State. The Bobcats are making substitutions. Holbrook inbounds the ball. They've got their defense and it's... Man, man. Leads him with the pass. The beautiful pass led straight to the layup by O'Connor. They take a 12-point lead. Texas State is really struggling. McGowan. It's stolen by O'Connor, and that'll be his second steal of the contest. The intercept. What great reflexes. He pounced in and picked that one off easily. Passes to the top of the key. Bush has it. Top of the key. Sizing up his man. Skip pass. Corner. Lemon. No good out of the corner. They've still got a 12-point lead. Rafik hands it off. 
Shafina raises up, bricks it off the front iron. As soon as he got the ball down there, the defense was all over him, making things difficult. All alone. Corralled by Shafino, and that's his sixth rebound of the game. About seven and a half minutes left in the second half. Last shot laid in by Walters. Incredible display of offensive firepower. It's been this way all game, Bill, and you have to wonder if one of these two teams will eventually run out of gas. O'Connor gets it on the inside. This is the first. Both teams are going to shake things up a little bit with some subs. Good on number two. Lewis is back in the game after a short rest. Walters inbounds the ball. The Bobcats can cut it to single digits. Rafik dishes to the right side. Shafino shoots. Can't cut the lead to single digits. They're still down eight. Top of the key. Kicks it out to the perimeter. The three was drained by Lapis. He's two for three from three-point range. The Bobcats are really struggling. Walters. Dumps it to the inside. Misses the easy one. Flipped it up and out. His team really needs him to hit that. Atchison buries the teardrop layup. They're up 68 to 52. About six and a half minutes left in the second half. Shafino gets it. Down low. Pass. Left wing. Rafik has it. Right side. Backs down. Releases. The shot from the right block was made by Shafino. 22 points and he's the top scorer. Bush beats it to the wing. That last three corner was missed by Louts. Rafik brings it up the floor. Lucky break for the defense. Whoever was supposed to be guarding him better wake up because the next time it won't be a miss. And he makes the first. The Bobcats are making substitutions. Puts the free throws. Top of the key. Atchison launches it. Cobra gets the board inside. A superior effort to fight through the foul and put it down. Strong move. He can't come away with a three-point play. In the key. Hold in by Bush. Nine times out of ten, he makes that. A little off, but not enough to deter him the next time. Swings it far side. Atchison passes it to the high post. The shot was short by Lapis, but they're still up by 50. Bounce pass, left wing. Walters. Green raises up. Green. Muscles in and snags the offensive rebound. Nice effort to get the shot off, but the foul threw up his concentration just enough. He misses the first. O'Connor got a quick breather, but they need him back on the floor. And he's going to come away empty from the line. And it's scooped up by Green. Hangs. Lout snatches it down inside. Dishes it to the left. Lout from the wing. Right in the bottom of the bucket. He's fourth for eight for the game. The Bobcats have got a lot of ground to make up. Beats it 
to the right wing. Randolph gets it. Cross court. Shoots it. The jumper was buried by Bree. The Gators will take a timeout here. Both teams are going to shake things up a little bit with some subs. Lemons inbounds the ball. Feeds left wing. Bush. Lemon throws it up. Colbrook snatches it down. O'Connor with Bucks. He's shooting 85% for the game. Texas State is really struggling. Left wing. Marcus Sovich. Dishes it to the right side. Three dumps it off. O'Connor gets the whistle for blocking, and that is his third foul so far. Well, he got there in time, but it looked like he was leaning when the Such contact the occurred. Marcus Sullivan will leave the floor, and he's really been struggling so far. Coggin gets it on the elbow. The tough shot. He nearly had a chance for a three-point play, but he'll go to the line for three. Down the first one. He's off on the second. Dumps it inside. Bush. Catches it on the perimeter. Atchison goes up. Almost a three-point opportunity. Instead, he'll go to the line for two. He makes the first. Marcus Silva hasn't had a good game so far, and he's going to sit down for a while. He gets the second to fall as well. Marcus Silva didn't sit for long, and he's coming back into the ball game. Three inbounds the ball. The Bobcats need to find some answers here. Mac. Lead pass down low. Stolen away by Bush. Lees it up and in. And they now lead by 20. Just over three minutes left in the second half. To the elbow. Feeds it to the strike. Three. Marcus Silva rips down the offensive rebound. The last shot laid gently in. First class body control. Not a lot of players have that kind of style. And he seems to do it every time. Passes to the left wing. Missed long by Lemons. They've still got an 18-point lead. Tosses it up. Grab by Marcus Sobich. Big time rejection. It seems like nothing can destroy this guy. But he will destroy you in a heartbeat. Texas State calls time. They've got one left. Three inbounds the ball. 229 left in the game. Shafino backs him down. Gets it. Middle. That last basket was nailed by Coggins. Passes like that make it so easy for the shooter. A bong dishes to the baseline from deep. Hits it. He's shooting 100% from long range. Left side. Shafino pulls the trigger. Frames it from eight feet out. They're now down by 19. Stolen by Texas State. I'd love to see that. He's looking around then pounce. Such a thief. Burn. Dumps it to the paint. Fires. The three-pointer knocked down by a ball. By 22. Texas State is really struggling. Shafino takes it up. Mim gets called for blocking, and that's his first foul. They need to be cautious, Fern. One more foul puts them over the limit. Bree inbounds the ball. Shafino, nice move. Hagen reels it in. 
Shafino picks up the foul for going over the back end, and that's his third foul. And that's good on the front end. Gets the second to fall as well. 110 left in the game. Passes to the strike. Deflected. And it's gathered up by Mims. Such great instincts. He knew exactly where the ball was going. Dicey pass. Pollock. Full net. Great job to hang on to the lead. They're doing it all out there. Shafino catches it outright. Backs down. Shoots from the post. Gets it to go. Working it down low. This guy is a warrior. And he can score in several different ways. If you don't double him, he will find a way to beat you. Skip pass to the middle. A bong. Sinks it. They should hold on to the lead, Vern. If they play smart, they can walk away with the win. They're going to need a miracle, Vern. Maybe even two. The steal by a ball. That last day is missed by Lapis. Has it. Top of the key. Three. Ends it off. Shafina feeds it to the corner. Backs him down. He rips down the rebound. He'll usually drop a shot like that. Don't count on him to miss it again. The ball on the money. Shafina inbounds the ball. That's all for this one. The Bobcats, 95 to 66. And now it's time to show you our player of the game. Now let's go back to Greg Gumbel with today's version of the Pontiac Game Changing Performance. Thanks, Vern. Welcome, everyone, to the 2K Sports Studios. I'm Greg Gumbel, and we're set to bring you the Pontiac game-changing performance. A slam dunk that brings the crowd to its feet? Always a fan favorite. The Florida Gators slam the door on their opponents with big-time dunks like the one you're seeing here. This is a dunk his teammates will be buzzing about for a while. Look at the fury with which he throws it through the hoop. Thank you, Greg. This is Vern Lundquist for Tracy Wolfson and Bill Raptor. 